Tuesday morning and everyone's still sleeping. So we have to be really, really quiet. <laughs> How y'all doing? Major Slack here. And uh, yeah, welcome back to Far Cry 2. And yes, it is indeed 5 o'clock Tuesday morning here in Montreal, Quebec. And it's fucking hot, let me tell you. So, enough bitching. Here we are in the APR headquarters. And um, yeah, I'm back to normal now. <laughs> I had my fun. I went postal, got my yayas out. And now let's go get the Act 2 finale mission. All right? Let's do it. Hey, dudes. Come what's in, up? My friend. I have excellent news. You do now, eh? What's that? I've been in contact with Mbatue. We have decided it's time to bring an end to this conflict. The people are troubled. Too much unrest. It has to end. Here. I want you to take this to Mbatue. He is okay. at a Seco brewery. Tell him I accept his terms. Go on. Take it. Okay. In exchange, he will give you a diamond attache case. Bring it here. And then we will know we have a good faith arrangement. Let's watch your back, mate. Times are changing. All right. <laughs> you look a little troubled there, Greaves. You all right? <laughs> Let's try this again. <laughs> okay. I'm just fucking with you. Relax. <laughs> See him out. I was just fucking with him. You know, chill out. <laughs> You're alright, Grease, right? Yeah, okay, he's alright. <laughs> right? <laughs> okay, so, as you hear the man say, um, we have to take this letter down to um, Tambosa at the Boa Seco Brewing Company at that red circle there, at the bottom of the lake, south end of the lake there. So that is the deal, that's our mission. And the way the bunny mission works this time is Nazreen is going to meet us right down at the bottom here. in Right here in the APR headquarters. There hey. she is. Good, I found you. This truce they're talking about, it's a bad idea. It is? I know you're taking this job for Tambosa and Bantue, but you look out for yourself at the same time. And your friends. You're picking up some diamonds, am I right? Yeah. Well, don't deliver them. No, why Bring not? them to us at the airstrip instead. We've arranged for a cargo plane to pick us up, but the pilot only stops if we can pay him. That's where your diamonds come in. And I'm doing this because why? Because you have a beautiful set of big tits? That's that's the only reason? Is there any other reason? What do I get out of this? Anything? <laughs> no answer, eh? Jeez. <laughs> okay. See what you Okay, I'll give it some thought. Hey, so listen, guard at the door, dude. Um, yeah, this looks like pretty much the last time we're going to be seeing each other. Uh, it's been really nice working with you. And, um, you know, oh, about all that stuff last time where I came to town and, you know, killed a hundred people. And, uh, you know, really sorry about that, you know. Um, nothing personal. <laughs> okay. And, yeah, so that's it. So, uh, you know, see you in the funny papers. <laughs> oh, yeah, by the way, I need your foul paratrooper. I'm kind of low on weapons here. <laughs> Something personal. So, anybody have any arguments about that? Anybody out there? Hmm? Okay. That's what I thought. No arguments. Oops, I'm out. Okay, time to leave town. <laughs> I know when I'm not wanted. <laughs> Shit. Made you slack them with postal again. <laughs> Oops, I did it again. I played with your guns and I blasted your brains. I made it oops <laughs> Oh no! Major Slack is singing Britney Spears! What do we do? 
It's the four horsemen of the apocalypse, Billy. Run for your lives. It's the end of the world. Oh, no. Ah! <laughs> okay. We will now resume your regularly scheduled programming. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah. I've come to the weapon shop for a couple of reasons. I want to buy out the last weapon that there is to buy. That is the Carl G. Rocket Launcher. And I also want to get a new loadout because um, I don't have any weapons to speak of. I used them all up in uh, <laughs> my last uh, run there, if it be proper to call it such. So just go watch the Slack Goes Postal videos and you'll see what I did. <coughs> Okay, so I'm going to buy up the Carl G. Rocket Launcher. That's the last weapon that remains to be bought. And after that, I will have purchased all the weapons in this game. And that leaves me 19 diamonds, and I think I'm going to buy the Assault Webbing, too, which will allow me to carry 150 rounds in all Assault Rifles, as opposed to just 90. And I know a number of you are getting uh, different numbers for that. I'm on the PC version, and that's that's what I get when I buy the assault webbing. 150 spare rounds, 30 in the clip, and 150 spare. All right, so as you can see, uh, the primary weapon wall is full. Got all the weapons, okay? And the secondary weapon wall is full. Got all those weapons, and now the special weapon wall is now full. Got all the weapons. So we have now purchased all the weapons in the game. They're all available here in the armory. Right, so I'm gonna take on this, uh, not that one, the Carl G. Rocket Launcher, right? And that's the last special weapon that we have yet to try yet. So I haven't tried it yet. yet. Meaning, you know, in this walkthrough, I've already played through this game like you know four or five times, you know. But in this walkthrough, I haven't tried it out yet. And um, <clears throat> hmm, since we have a secondary weapon crate, let's load something into it. Let's load a uh, grenade launcher into it. Put that in there. And let's take on the flare pistol. That is the only secondary weapon I have yet to try yet. I've tried everything else. So this is going to be a weird loadout. And finally, let's put a Dragonoff sniper rifle into the primary weapon crate. Right? Pick that up later, we're going to be needing it. And I'm going to take on the AK-47, one of my favorite assault rifles in the game. If I had to choose an assault rifle, normally, as you know, my loadout, my preferred loadout is the Dragonoff Sniper Rifle, the Uzi or the Mag-10, whichever is available, and the RPG-7 Rocket Launcher. That's my preferred loadout. But if I had to choose an assault rifle, it would definitely be the AK-47 over the Foul Paratrooper. I prefer it over the Foul Paratrooper. Alright, so that's your little. Oops. Gotta get some ammo. Ammo up here, fuel up. Grab some nades and explosives and whatnot, and we're ready to rock and roll. Okay, so here's our new loadout machete. Um. <laughs> flare pistol. <laughs> Let's see how that works out. 8K47. The AK-47, when you absolutely got to kill every motherfucker in the room, except no substitute. <laughs> okay, quick. Which movie is that line about the AK-47 from? Alright? That line about the AK-47 is from a movie. State the movie in a comment, and you win the contest. If you win the contest, you get a thumbs up on your comment, and you get honorable mention in my next batch of videos. And you also get a seagull to squawk along with you with your victory dance. <laughs> Alright, and finally, here's the Carl G. Rocket Launcher, and I'll show you all about that later. Alright, All right. so... Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. You know what? Let's go on a diamond run. Okay? Let's try to collect up all the diamonds in the east sector and the southeast sector. Okay, kind of take a roundabout route to get down there to the Boa Seco Brewery and Company. All right, so that is the plan. Bit of a detour here. And 
I hear a patrol? Should I stop to engage? Yeah. Lots of action up ahead. Okay, as soon as the map switches over, I'm going to tell you what the plan is. 